Uh, this is my work um, about Amazon. Um, although I work for Amazon also for uh, nearly uh, six to seven years now. So uh, I did uh, my work about the company. So my name is Chernoba and that's my ID number. So um, I just started with a brief introduction here. Um, like as we know, um, Amazon is started from uh, a bookseller to the world most valuable company currently, and it has uh signed the world since uh, 24, 24 years ago now, and gradually it became it become the world uh, technology leader in the e-commerce sector, and it's literally expanding through the world. Um, initially um quickly and also uh, despite it being the, the one of the largest uh like the the trillion company a uh, trillion dollar company it has brought an enormous benefit in the world such as uh, jobs creation um apprenticeship careers uh, charity shops and much more So now um, this is the the problem statement. So um, as um, we said, we're just gonna go straight away, uh, straight away, straight away to the point. Uh, we won't be uh, just writing a lot of this or reading the whole test. We're just gonna literally resume what's the problem and uh, what's the solution uh, should be for them. So <clears throat> here now uh, the problem we identified uh, from the company. Although, like as I said in the initial I work there, so um, uh, I know a lot of a lot of things in there and a bit more um, about the company's issues. So one of the issues they have is to um, is cutting costs. There's some staffs in there that literally um, people undermine, especially uh, like the environment problems. Um, you know where. Uh, a lot of things in there so but one of the main problem they have is cutting the cost of all, of all those stuffs so and also causing the pollutions as we know amazon use cardboard um and plastics to package the customers um to package the customers shipments so and also they use glue and all those things are natural resources and they all can be reusable they can uh, be reused and also uh, as we know they are the one of the largest distributor uh, of shipments in Europe and in America and then uh, they're expanding, uh, expanding at the moment in Asia in and in, in some of the African countries um, so now if we estimate uh, like um, uh, Amazon um, like they have more than 20,000 vans and trucks operating daily just literally in the UK which contribute enormously in the world pollution so this is one of the problem is the environment and the pollution and all those things is thing we need to take in account of so the second problem they have um, is in the warehouse in there so in the warehouse where uh, Amazon literally operation goes uh, they have um, uh, like a theft control issues so there's a lot of stuff that especially the drivers they have the bags where the shipment should be in they literally uh, don't have any type of um, control in terms of uh, the bags so they're ordering a lot of bags and we know those bags and also those raw materials literally they are directly linked to the environment so a lot of shipment a lot of bags when they go out with the delivery drivers they never come back literally at the station uh, drivers either throw them away or sell them sometimes you know this is all uh, this kind of issues this is a third problem literally as i said the first page now there's three problem present. So first one is the um, environment issues, such as uh, using the natural resources, and the second one is the pollution, 
and the third one is theft control in the warehouses or workplaces from Amazon so uh, the solution that I brought for them uh, some recommendation is one of the solutions like that I've recommended is to adopt in their workplaces uh, like literally they, they they should like you know a uh, scale um weight in the scale uh, more uh, you know cares about the green planet uh similarly of the cutting costs as well like which is uh which will be maybe um you know really efficient for them um the second thing um uh, i've recommended them is to use um is for the uh, implementing a reusable um, you know, uh, shops or in, a, in some system that they can, uh, you know, uh, encourage people to drop their empty shipments such as plastic, cardboard, etc. Uh, in order to like, you know, uh, to bribe them to bring the the those those one for 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 to be reused. So the third. The, the the one of the, the other solution as well is to use a microchip called RFD, so which will be implemented in the bag. So those one the bags can be tracked from the warehouse from the system, like in the web um, that they can assign a team to do that. So the third solution they uh, that I offer them also is to make sure um you know to be in part of the uh, green planet contribution such as using electric cars so which we which is less cost even though they're one of the biggest companies e-commerce on e-commerce they can invest in this and uh, be successful and yeah um and then uh, that will even uh, put them further to the uh, to the competitors so this is a graph uh, just uh, um that I've just um, uh, put here to show the um, the increase in terms of revenue and then the Green Planet project. Uh, yeah, this is the personal analysis, the risks identified, and then this is the personal an analysis. This is the cause and the effects, like uh, the traffic areas, for infrastructures, whatever they're investing, and then the effort will be customer, uh, poor customer services, losing customers, complaint from customers, uh, cost literally. Etc. This is the pyramid principle, as as we see here. Like in terms of the delivery section, uh, we have the the like the fulfillment center, the delivery station, like just the possibilities that they can have uh, with the partners as well with the local partners. That's a brand analysis as well. This is the brand analysis details. That's the SWOT as well. It's a vital to use literally to scan organizational environment. Um, this is the strength and the weakness they have, the opportunities and the treats literally, and then the competitor privilege. It is important to highlight the competitor privilege because it's, it's one of the biggest company, and then a lot of competitors literally will look into their uh, solutions or learn uh, and or in their weaknesses, and they improve in that sector in order to be uh, more competitive to them uh, so as we said also Amazon expansion worldly uh, versus local companies will challenge will be challenging and also the internet uses is quite not some of the densities continent countries uh, like India or Africa um, so however the competitors such as dpd has time literally this is one of the advantages that the competitors have and then they need to improve like a dpd they have a time frame where they have to tell the customer or send the customer a uh, text message saying okay we deliver between this time and to this time and then most of the time most most of the time they respect the hours whereas it's different to amazon similarly to raymel as well so now, in terms of their expansion uh, problems uh, or issues, this is one of the things that they need to look at. Although this is one of the biggest advantages they have, they have an app. Uh, like if we look at the internet usages and the devices in the worldwide, according to Google survey in 2008, desktop represent 44%, laptops 36%, mobile phone 98%, which is really useful for them. They go an app that literally 
it got interlinked in all the devices and work is literally every in every device this is the personal analysis like in terms of uh, political economical technological and legal and also as we know amazon is one of the companies that submit the uh, international laws which means in any country or any continent they go to expand their like their um, station or their services they mostly protected on their the mostly under the protection of uh, international laws um so now this is the conclusion uh to conclude the report and uh, says that i have dived deep deeply into their existing data i would say with my personal analysis and understanding there are great opportunities for amazon to include the method of cutting costs by implementing it services alongside with the green world project so meaning they they literally seeing their potential they can be much more better than uh, like much more better in in the future and maintain this position for quite long um years as well um and also as you've seen like um in the present uh day literally the position of the world economic especially in the pandemic of this pandemic pandemic crisis on online digital have seen their sales gradually increasing which means it's one of the best thing we, we've seen even local shops literally uh, going to Amazon giving them their packages in order for them to deliver for them so it increased their um, wealth and their position in the world and also it strengthened their brands uh, across the world so this is the reference and uh, the video link will be just shortly after I cut the video thank you very much